Hey guys, so let's take a few minutes and talk about the process of switching from one page template structure to another one. And this is uh, this video is primarily for those of you who've uh, purchased, installed, and started to use your theme before August 20th, 2017. So what I'm going to do is open up my About page in two different tabs. So you can see I have About page here and About page here. So two different tabs, uh, same page opened up. Uh, next, what you want to do is make sure that you uh, install and activate our Flow Launch plugin. That way you can create a duplicate of your website and work on transitioning any pages behind the scenes so you users don't see uh, all of that uh, difference and all of that mess that may be going on with uh, the template switch. Okay, so let's just say that we've installed and activated our Flow Launch plugin. We've created our website uh, database backup, and uh, now we can go ahead and proceed with the changes. So what you would want to do is take this page and switch over to default page template. Uh, once again, make sure that you have your original about page open. That way we can copy paste content into our second page because the structures are identical. So we switch over to uh, the default page template, go ahead, click on update, and um, we'll then switch over to the uh, layout section once our page loads. Give it just a second. Okay. There we go. So we are in the default page template. Head on over to layouts, select your about page. Okay, then click on apply template, confirm. And at this point, what you're going to have to do is unfold these settings and simply copy paste all of this content uh, from this page to this page over here. So basically, uh, everything's super simple. You have the title, copy, paste it here. Next off, you scroll down with your content text. Uh, here we have the content text, so copy this content text, add it here. And next we have uh, contact button, contact link, all of that good stuff. It's all super simple. It's just a matter of copy paste, really. Um, once again, featured images, uh, display, featured image description, and so forth. All of this stuff is super simple. Once again, simply copy paste all of that stuff here. Uh, once everything has been finalized, once you've added all of your content, uh, we're just going to skip this uh, section over here just for the sake of this video. So once you've added all of your content, uh, simply go ahead and click on update and your about page will be updated. Uh, then go ahead um, and publish your new version of the website and deactivate Flow Launch plugin. So this would probably be one of the easiest ways around this, um, but one thing to keep in mind regarding Flow Launch plugin is that depending on how much content or how large your database website is, it may take a little while for it to back up, for example. So it may be easier for you just to have that um, one to two minutes of downtime or pick a time whenever you have less traffic coming to your website and make the transition uh, during those times. The other option is um, if you decide to, um, if you actually want to go through the process of, let's say, changing your permalinks. So what that would look like for you is you go over to Pages, uh, click on Add New, and uh, you add in your page title. So this would be, let's say, About New. So we'll go ahead and click on Publish. This would be About Old, just so we can remember uh, which page is which because we're going to have to make changes within our menu as well. Okay, so we clicked on update. Uh, next off, we add in all of our content to the about new page. So we select our page template and so forth. Everything has been added here. Uh, the only thing is that we have the following permalink that needs to be changed as well. Okay, so in order for that to happen, what you're going to have to do is open up uh, your uh, about old page, click on edit, and change this to about, make sure you have a dash, so about dash old, click on update, and then this page over here, click on edit, remove new, and then this would simply be about, and then click on update, then you want to go over to appearance, go to menus, and here we have our about new page that we've created. So click here, click on Add to Menu. It'll then be added to the bottom. You want to make sure that you drag it to um, 
wherever it may be so let's say the top of the page and this about one is actually the about new page or I'm sorry the about old page so what you're gonna want to do is go ahead and remove your about old and um, then open up the settings and change the navigation label so this would be about and then click on save menu okay and then once that is taken care of you can go ahead move this about old page to trash and if needed adjust the page title as well and click on update okay uh, this is just another another way how you can make updates to um, pretty much any page not just the about page uh, but once again you are going to have to change out the permalinks and make sure that you change it within um, your navigation menu another thing to keep in mind regarding this specific uh, process is that if you have any other buttons on your website linking to the about page make sure that um, those links are structured properly make sure that this link over here is identical to whatever you previously had that way um, any any external links will lead back to the to the original page and uh, there won't be any errors with that okay so I hope everything makes sense in the following video guys and um, yeah thanks for watching and I'll see you around later